Hi Famous here Today we are gonna try to solo Earl again But continuing from my previous Ghost Rifle build Today we are not gonna sneak So weapon that we are gonna use is Plasma Rifle Wait. Okay this one So this is just a 2 star anti armor faster fire rate With true flamer barrel And prime capacitor So because you are not using style, you have to change the perk. So we have to remove the perks that related to sneak. But of course, since we don't use any explosion, we can replace this with gunsmith. Because the durability of plasma flamer is not really that great. And then we are not gonna use uh, escape artist, Mr. Seman, covert operative. And we're not gonna use fat, so gun fu is not important here. And and then you can see I have dodgy level two. You can get rid of it and change for the level three dodgy. And then we have six left. You can really put anything on it. Like for me, because I bring a lot of food and drink. I'll take through hiker, and then three extreme boy, and then. We can remove critical safety and better criticals with bloody mess and ricochet. Okay, that's it for the perk. And we are gonna use power armor. You can use any, any power armor you want. Okay, let's go. Alright, now while we are waiting for Earl Timer, uh, I forgot something about my perk, so I can't take off my Stinish number and Happy Camper with Lone Wanderer here because we are doing it solo. And then about my buff, actually it's not really different with the Ghost Rifle build, so the most important thing is Nerd Rage. And also emergency protocols. All oh, right, I haven't show you my power armor mod, so I'll show you after this. And for food buff, blood soup here is not really that important because we are not gonna use crit damage. So yeah, I mean bonus XP is really really good, but we don't really need this for soloing Earl and does not have any relation with damage so but mutation is also all the same adrenal reaction for low health damage and then happy 4 for more XP <laughs> again no relation with damage also my power armor is here it's a x01 because of visual reason this is just my opinion because I like it and uh, for the mods, it is using internal database, more in, more experience for the head. And uh, for torso, I'm using emergency protocols here because we are gonna just take like 50% damage, which is really powerful and really important for bloody build. And then we we're gonna use uh, not no mod here <laughs> in my left arm because. I don't know, I don't have, I don't find any important mod, mods for my left arm and calibrated shocks, more carry weight is always very useful. Okay, so my legendary perk is just swap out the follow through with sizzling style. I mean, I don't know, ammo factor is really important because this build is really hungry for the ammunition but we do need the fire damage resistance because our fire damage is really crazy especially when you're using bloody will so yeah that's it okay, it's time to go liquid courage I hope it's heavy I don't know how to pronounce it <laughs> Let's go. Alright, I'll 
I'll use one more energy weapons and guns and bullets seven.
Okay, so that's the earth fight. Let's see how many ammunition we consume. So I think we are we consume like four thousand or less. Yeah, I think we consume around like three thousand. 500 something which is not really that bad because I expect worse than this but the problem is really the durability here I even use gunsmith level 5 so <laughs> I think if you're gonna solo earl with plasma rifle you need at least two plasma rifles alright that's it for the plasma rifle build if you enjoy this video please like comment and subscribe See you in the next video.